welcome back to my channel it's me marley today i'm just doing just a quick get ready with me um once again i am taking my little brother to the mall but this time to get a backpack because um school starts tomorrow and we just did a smoky eye using um blue valentine and i just used two new products today that uh, you guys will see in this video that are coming soon to my brand which I'm really excited about. Oh and real quick these contacts are from Iris Beauty. Sent me two colors and this is in the color Glam Gray. Really beautiful, really comfortable. I do have a coupon code down below. You guys are always asking me where I get my contacts so um, and I've actually my previous contacts I've been wearing for months and I do not recommend that you always want to change your contacts at least once a month do not be like me because you're gonna end up going fucking blind but um yeah so these are from iris beauty and they are prescription I am so blind you guys I know I have big ass eyes but I cannot see for shit I wear glasses in real life um so yeah so this is in the shade glam gray from iris beauty Please check them out if you want to just getting to get into wearing colored contacts or if you do wear contacts already and um, you just want to try a new brand, I highly, highly, highly recommend them. And then also at the end of this video, I show you guys my outfit. I promise I will show you guys some clothing hauls and most of my shit is like vintage thrift, um, which I just, I love. And if you want to, so if you want to see how I got this eye look and you want to see my outfit just for today, then keep on watching. So I kind of just want to wear something that matches my shirt a little bit, but not doing too much. I kind of want to wear Blue Valentine today from the Love and Despair set, which I think my next video, the video after this, I'll introduce that set because um, it's just a beautiful set. And I'm just going to do a really quick eye look because um, I'm taking my brother to the mall today. And the mall closes at 6, so I don't want to take too long. I just want this to be a really quick look. And at the end of this tutorial, I will show you guys my outfit. Because you guys are always asking what it is that I wear. You guys want to see my clothes and all that good shit. So I'm going to take this color right here and then just put that all over the eye. Yeah, so since I moved back to my mom's, I mean, I'm not gonna lie, my life has been a mess. Work is taking over. And then with the Seven Deadly Sins palette, I'm gonna go in with Lust, and I'm just gonna blow that all out, all over the eye today. I'm gonna take this up and blow it out. Yeah, so I'm taking a little brother to get a book bag today. I think I'm gonna take him to Spencer's. It's like our favorite store. We always go in there. And I saw some like really cool backpacks last time. So, you know, just wanna elevate him up. I think he's a junior this year, I'm not sure. Who knows? Kids, they grow up so fast. If he doesn't find anything there, um, of course, I'll take him to Hot Topic, and then if not there, then I don't fucking know. I don't know. I don't know any other like stores around here. Maybe like I don't know. JC Penny. Like, where are the kids shopping at today? If not Hot Topic, at like your local suburban mall. Which is a good and bad thing. Then I'm gonna take a def, put that right into the crease. Give a nice little darker blue transition going on. Just threw this wig on. This is the wig that um, I've been wearing in my previous videos. I think that everyone should have just like a throw on wig that um, doesn't look too crazy. Um, of course, I'm going to do a wig install video. I'm just waiting on um, a few more wigs to get here. So I can do that because I already reviewed that one. And um, yeah, we'll get started on some wigs. And before we eye glitter, I'm going in with this sample Glam Goth Beauty product. And it is a gel eyeliner that I did use for my eyebrows today, which I love. I think they look fucking great. Um, I think 
I think, I think, I think um, I'm gonna use this color pop angled brush. I think I'm gonna name this color Vengeance. Cause like, that's just the mood. I just love what Vengeance stands for and I think it can be just such a positive thing, you know? You can be vengeful um, just with like getting your life back together. It doesn't always have to mean like you're about to like ruin somebody's life, you know? Even though my brows are um, very vengeful, to me they're more triumphant, you know? Like I feel like my arch and my brow, I fucking like I earned it, like for real. Off like, off no bullshit, like I feel like i just been through so much through my life, like with every like crazy fucked up situation. I would arch my brows a little bit more and a little bit more and now they're just like at a point where like they're not taking no bullshit so but i'm gonna name them vengeance because that just sounds better all right so let's smoke this out down here we're going very punk rock today why not i'm just gonna go back in with lust and messily smoke this out. Is messily a word? <laughs> messily. Sorry, my whole entire family is home today. So they are just, my mom is cooking. My dad is like all over the place. I'm gonna take my diamond primer, put that all over the lid. Or should we just hit it in the center? Or let's see, let's see what I, where I wanna put it today. We're not cutting no creases out. I want to mix blue valentine. Let's mix blue valentine with white walker. Yes, because I want some chunkiness. This is blue valentine. She is a blue and red glitter. We'll prop her up right here so you guys can see her. And she is inspired by the iconic horror love movie blue valentine if you haven't seen it watch it it's one of my favorite 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 movies just such a good movie i'm not even gonna talk about it because um i want you guys to watch it i feel like um explaining things kind of take away the magic of a movie like you just need to watch it and see it for yourself and i'm just taking that glitter on a b83 brush want to take her in over here we have just a little bit of fall which is totally fine love how this looks should we do a wing hmm yeah but I am gonna do a liner up top I'm gonna take my NYX vinyl liner, Let's do a line up top. I wouldn't even say Blue Valentine is a horror movie, it's more like a thriller. I also love movies that have like a crazy, like, woman in them and she's like fabulous yeah i just feel like i can relate to her more lashes oh so i have some sample lashes here from glam goth beauty that um i need to try every single one before i make final decisions let me try these okay so i can I can't show you the box, but um, they look like this, and I feel like, I just feel like these will be really dope because you can see like little pieces of glitter, but let's see, let's fucking let's test this shit out first. I'm just gonna cut off that little piece of band right there, I hate that part. If you are new to lashes, you always want to them on your eye first before you put them on 
Um, I just, I've been wearing lashes for like years, so I know my eye. I usually don't have to customize the lash, like cut it to, for it to fit my eye. Um, I think y'all know why my eyes are fucking huge. They are big as hell. My eyes are usually like the first thing that like what people like, when they just have to say something about me. And I've been called everything, a fish, a bug, I'm scary, my eyes are scary looking, like I've heard it all. But the bigger the lash, like if you have a big, if you have big eyes and you just do a big, full, beautiful lash, oh my God, like, girl, the power. So I like to stick that right in the middle and then secure the sides. Let's move this over a little bit. So, if you want the focus to be on the eyes, you can leave the lip nude. I have no idea what I want to do today, but um, I low-key want to go... Actually, we'll do nude. We'll leave it nude today. I want to try out the dark brown shade that I was telling you guys about in my last video. Um, I believe I'm going to name this shade Oblivion. Um, I want all my lip products to be inspired by the end of the world because um, she's coming. We have the black one is called Apocalypse and then the dark brown one is Oblivion. I'm just gonna line my lips with this. I feel like everyone needs a dark brown shade in their lipstick collection. Ooh, pretty. What do you guys think? I would like to know. And then I'm gonna go in with Libra from the Il Maquillage and Carly Bible collab. Low-key, this is what I wanted the liner to be like to go with this lipstick. Um, I think that she more so made it for her complexion and for her skin tone, but um, you know, I'm chocolate, you know, I need a little bit of mocha in my life. Now, if I was going out, if I was going like out, out, like to like somewhere that was not um, as basic as the fucking mall, I would wear this with a dark lip to make it just more grungy, a little bit more rock and roll, punk rock, whatever. But um, I just wanted to keep the focus on the eyes and just, you know, just do a little something, something for today. Fuck. And I'm gonna go in with Fortune Cookie and Fortune Cookie from NYX just brightens up the lip in just such a nice way. And then for my hair, like I said, I just threw this wig on. I low key even might wear a hat today. Um, just kind of like go like this, run my fingers. I totally forgot to put my glow oil on. And this is in the shade Golden. And I like to mix Golden and Caramel. why not since this part of my body is showing I just love how this smells and how it looks oh, oh, wash the chains the necklaces are from shop nasty gem really cool girl from the DMV she hand makes all her shit and um, I love these and then we're gonna spray with some urban decay Right down here too. Actually, a few more. And let's mix that in with the Smashbox because I don't want to be too matte today. 
so let me go um, get my the shoes that I'm wearing for today from my room. And then um, I'm probably just gonna grab a jacket because it's finally chilly outside. I, I feel like I've been waiting forever for this. So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so this is my outfit for today. I'm gonna do a close up on my shirt so you guys can see the detail. I feel very like jade from uh, the broad stalls. I'm just wearing a Chucky pentagram shirt. I just cut off the top so it shows my tattoos and I'm just more comfortable. I get so claustrophobic in collared shirts and um, just ripped it down the middle. I put some um, safety pins on it right here. And I cut a slit down here and put some safety pins on it right here. These are black craft cult pants, um, size 17 that I got from Hot Topic. And this is them from the side. Oh my god, my tilt's so horrible. I can't even believe I'm showing my feet right now. My shoes are from Demonia. These from pleasers.com. They're my, my favorite like little slip-on shoes if I don't want to wear slides. And I'm just going to be running in and out real quick. Typically, I would wear this outfit with some boots. I believe I got this jacket from a thrift store in LA. I'm wearing it with my Killstar bag. And I'll typically just like wear it like this. Um, so yeah, so that is my outfit for today. Just paired it with these like circular glasses. Um, I believe I got these just from a kiosk in the mall. Like I will buy anything from anywhere as long as it's fucking cute. But yeah, this is my outfit for today. Um, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching this tutorial. I will have more clothing hauls soon and i love you guys bye